Hello and welcome back. Today we will talk about the light reactions and the dark reactions. The last time we talked about the light reactions and today we will talk about the dark reactions. So, at the end of the last time we mentioned that the light reactions ends with two substances which are the NADPH2 and the ADP. So, the hydrogen molecule here carried by this hydrogen carrier in ADP, nicotinamide adenine dinucleotide phosphate, it carries the hydrogen. So, why does it carry the hydrogen? Actually, the hydrogen here is used to fix the carbon dioxide into carbohydrates. And of course, by the manufacturing of the carbohydrates, the plant makes its own food. So, this is the role of the hydrogen here. By the help of the energy stored in the ADP molecule, and that's how the carbohydrates are formed. To satisfy these results of the dark reaction, a scientist called Melvin Calvin in nineteen forty nine, he's from California University, in nineteen forty nine he used the newly discovered radioactive isotope of carbon. We know that the normal carbon is 12. Well, the radioactive one was 14, and it was newly discovered then, at that time, in 1949. So he used this radioactive carbon to testify for the results that we obtained here, and to show what the first product of the dark reactions. So he made an apparatus that looked like this. So, here we have chlorella alga, green alga, and here we have carbon dioxide, and of course carbon dioxide is important in the dark reactions, because we said that the hydrogen carried by the NADPH2 helps in fixing the carbon dioxide into carbohydrates. So it's important in the dark reactions. And here we have source of light. So this circular flask and these are two stoppers or bulbs. Those are two bulbs. And here this is hot alcohol. So here in the carbon dioxide you use the radioactive isotope and the carbon dioxide passes here through the connecting tube to this flask where the chloral alga is found and this is the dimmest light that he could assure the photosynthesis will take place with. He didn't use much light because he didn't want to see the results of the light reactions, he wanted the dark reactions 